So I want to shift to internal. This is where it gets a little harder. Um, so when internal issues happen, like we've seen with Starbucks, Nike, Uber, and everything typically ends up in the pu public realm, how does it change how you communicate as a leader? Aman, do you want to comment on that? Yeah, I, I, you know, I personally welcome this shift. Um, you know, I'm a believer that uh, transparency is critical to pretty much all growth on the planet. We, we have so much opportunity for all of us together. You know, if we can be more transparent, it allows for the others to see those opportunities. So for me, you know, if, if we go back decades, the CEO was maybe somebody that was in a corner office somewhere and you had to go through layers of people to get to them. Now you can get to them on a Twitter handle. Right? It, they're just more transparent, they're much more approachable. So this idea that you know, there's an internal issue, it actually in some ways frees the CEO to be able to act. Mm -hmm. And you know, in, in those examples that, that you just gave, you, we saw the CEOs act. Right? And I, I welcome that. I think it goes really well, and maybe it's, I welcome it because it goes really well with the core philosophy, which is you know, if you want to be a better leader, be a better person.